is waiting for me when we first met. There's no reason to be nervous. Right? Yeah. Right. There she is. <laughs> You must feel pretty good. Got your sister back, your people. What's next for the woman of the hour? <laughs> You're the one who ripped apart a metal devil from the inside. I think you should get a bit of credit too. Well, maybe a little. <laughs> As for what's next, the Admiral's going to need my help to reunite our half of the expedition with Alva up north. And after that, I don't know. I don't think things will ever be the same with my sister or my people. You're not gonna sail back with him? I wanna see home again, someday. But things have changed. The Quen don't know what to do with me and I don't know where I fit in. I guess you know what that's like. For a long time, I hated the idea of home. For me, it meant where I grew up, where I wasn't wanted. But the thing is, the last few months, I've realized that home isn't really a place at all. It's more like the people I want to be with. I like that. And, well, more and more I've been thinking, I want to be with you. And I was hoping that you felt the same way. And what if I do? enough to know how you feel. I don't know when I'm gonna see you again. Me either. But no matter what happens, just don't forget about me. Okay? Everything we've been through. Fighting machines, fighting the Horus, fighting Londra. That has been my life for two years. Just one enemy after another with the biggest still to come. There's so much at stake. I try not to think about it, but when I do, sometimes I can barely breathe. Just, it's all I can handle. I just don't have room for anything else. Of course, it, it can't be easy for you. I 
know this isn't easy for you either. Dealing with your sister and your tribe and your future with them. But I know you can handle it. Because you're strong and you care. You're an example to everyone. Especially me. I'll miss you, Aloy. Thank you for everything. I mean it. Take care of yourself.